My name is David Badman. I've been in Grand Forks since the mid 70s and started a company downtown in 1988. My big passion is still metalworking. Uh, on the side, I enjoy cooking and a little combat art. It happened over quite a few years where things started to feel odd in my hip and I couldn't figure out what it was and no one was able to quite nail it down. Uh, things started to tear in there. Uh, I have a very active life, so it got to the point where I went in and talked to my physician, Dr. Joe Walls, and he looked at my x-ray and said, you need to go talk to the orthopedics. My name is Jeremy Gardner. Uh, I work in orthopedic surgery here at Altru since uh, 2010. Many times we're dealing with arthritis. From there, we start to formulate a plan with the patient. And in many cases, uh, if the arthritis has progressed to a point, uh, surgery does become an option. By the time I was talking to him, I was unable to walk without a cane. If I dropped something on the floor, I just kicked it underneath something because there was no way I was going to reach down and pick it up. And, and I truly, if I were to go down on my knee to do that, there I would need help to get back up. We typically take a 3D model of the patient's uh, hip using a CT scan. From that CT scan, we can position the implants and figure out exactly how we're going to fit this implant and hip replacement to that patient. And so we can really customize it and make it fit the needs of that patient. And then we proceed to the operating room and we execute that plan. So with robotic assisted, we can be very precise in how we put the hip replacement in, which improves the uh, performance of the hip and likely the longevity of how long that hip lasts. Everything went so smoothly. Uh, everyone handled me so well. Uh, and then I went into surgery, came out of surgery. It was a great experience working with uh, the occupational therapist to make sure I could walk a set of stairs with some crutches and walk down the hallway. And, and at that point, it was later in the day and they sent me home. So it, this whole process happened in one day and that was fantastic. But it's been two years for me to truly forget some days, full days that it happened. I actually waited far too long. I would tell people, when it's time, don't think another four months or something, it's time to do it.